So we have a logical conclusion following or not from the premises. We have two premises. Uh, so we're going to need to make some shorthand for these. So the first one is all perceptions of our mind's operations are reflections. So there's two parts of this. So perceptions of our mind's operations is one uh, statement or one thing. And then thoughts. So there's three things. There's perceptions, reflections, and thoughts. So let's do the first premise. All perceptions are reflections. So perceptions, and I'm just going to highlight what I'm going to actually use. So the of our mind's operations is not really necessary, and it's only going to confuse you to think about that. So we're just going to call these perceptions. So it says all perceptions are reflections. So if we make a Venn diagram, all perceptions are reflections. So perceptions live inside the set of all reflections. The second premise is some thoughts are not perceptions of our mind's operations. Some thoughts, so we're going to introduce thoughts here, are not perceptions. So what this is saying, it's not saying there may be some thoughts inside perceptions, but it's saying that there are some thoughts that are not perceptions. So their thoughts could live either in here or out here, but they need to live in one of these two or both places. So there could be thoughts that thoughts are not. There are some thoughts that are not perceptions, but it says nothing about if these thoughts are reflections or not. So the conclusion is some thoughts are not reflections. Well, we don't know if some thoughts go here or here. They could go either place. So I put the question mark there. It's possible that they're, they're all living right here and none are outside. It's also possible they're all here and none are inside. So we cannot determine some thoughts are not reflections. It's possible that there's nothing out here. And so we cannot directly conclude that some thoughts are not reflections. And the counterexample of this happening is if thoughts, thoughts, some thoughts are not perceptions, but they could all be reflections. So just because they're not perceptions doesn't mean that there are some thoughts that live outside of reflections here. So we're going to go invalid because you can't make that conclusion.